in this problem, we're asked to determine what the final project products are of uh, certain types of radiation. So we have uh, plutonium, uh, 24294 plutonium that undergoes alpha decay, and we want to determine exactly what we have left. So alpha decay is just releasing a helium nucleus. Okay, a helium nucleus is 42. 4,2 helium plus whatever we have left from here. Well, basically, we just subtract off our totals from this. So we're going to have 238,92. Okay, so we lose a total of two protons, give us 92. We lose a total of four particles, neutrons and protons, to give us 238. Okay. And 92 is what determines what this element is. 92 is uranium. If we look at our periodic table, so that's our answer for that one. Okay, in the second case, we are undergoing beta minus decay. So beta minus decay is when a neutron decays to a proton and an electron. Okay, so we're losing a neutron, gaining a proton and an electron. So if we lose a neutron and gain a proton, this stays the same. We lose a neutron, but we gain a proton. That means that we gain a proton. This goes to 12. So we have 24, 12. And 12 happens to be magnesium. Manganese. And we still have our extra electron. And that's how we show an electron. Okay. Now, the last part, we have nitrogen that is undergoing beta plus decay. Now, beta plus decay happens when a proton transforms to a neutron and a positron. Okay? So, we're, this time, we're at, it's the opposite of this kind of. It's instead of neutron to pro proton, we have proton to neutron. So, 13 stays the same again, because we're just transforming a proton to a neutron, but we're losing a proton, and this is going to 6. 6 is carbon, so now we, now we have carbon-13, plus we get a positron, and that's plus 1e. E. So this denotes a positron, and this is an electron, and those are your final answers.